the official sponsored glove for the One Championship over in Asia. In this video, I'm gonna be talking all about the Fairtex MMA glove we have for sale at Enzo Martial Arts. I'm gonna be talking all about its features, where it sits in the world of MMA gloves out there on the market, and at the end, I'm gonna to put together a short montage of people training and competing with the Fairtex MMA glove. Hi, my name is Doug Swift. I've been doing martial arts for the past 34 years and I've been the owner of Enzo Martial Arts for the past 17 years. If you're liking this video, click the little icon down below, subscribe to this channel and get all the latest videos on all the products we have for sale here at Enzo Martial Arts. So let's get into this video and learn all about the Fairtex MMA glove we have for sale at Enzo. So as a seller of martial arts products, I like to think I've been around the kind of MMA scene, as it were, relatively since the beginning of it in the UK here. Now, I probably went to my first MMA show around 2006, 2007, something like that, to sell kit there. So not quite at the beginning, but relatively early on in the MMA kind of lifespan in the UK in terms of, certainly in terms of cage fighting. Now, even back then, these Fairtex MMA gloves, maybe not this exact like design, but Fairtex MMA gloves were perceived as being the top glove. Now, lots of gloves have come and gone and, you know, different brands have built up and disappeared or sort of trundled along alongside Fairtex. But Fairtex have always remained one of the top, top gloves you can use in MMA. So as you probably know, Fairtex is a Thailand brand. So it's a Thai boxing brand specifically. And the majority of the stuff they make is for Thai boxing. So they got in there very, very early with this glove and they did it right from the beginning. And it's just managed to stay in the market and be a very popular glove and a very, very well-made glove that suits MMA very, very well from the beginning. They did it right early on and they've kind of just stayed there as one of the top gloves all the way through. Now in the very, very early days of MMA, before my time really in terms of selling kit, the cage fighting scene didn't wear gloves at all. They didn't need them, um, well, they didn't need them. They didn't think they needed them and it was just all bare knuckle in a tape cage, two guys from two different martial arts. Now what they found is while they were hitting people, they were actually really damaging their hands. And this was this was absolute disaster and people ended up slapping each other and you know, this isn't what people wanted in cage fighting. They wanted to be able to punch each other. So what they developed was this four ounce glove. Boxing gloves were just seen as too bulky. You can grab, you can grapple. So they needed a glove you could grapple in and you needed one that you could punch it sort of still felt like a bare knuckle to a point, but you need to be able to move your hands and all the rest of it. And this is what they came up with, the four ounce MMA glove. And this has become kind of the standard for competition fighting in MMA. Now, you do also get an MMA sparring glove, which we do sell. We do sell the Fairtex sparring glove. So if you're interested in that as well, go and have a look on our website, much more bulky. Still hurts when you get hit with it, but nowhere near as much as this four ounce. The four ounce is definitely designed in a way to be like a bare knuckle, but without breaking breaking your hand to bits. So let's have a look at this actual glove. Now you can see from the Pope profile that this Fairtex glove is already pre-curved. And there's not a lot of MMA gloves out there that are like that. The sparring ones are more curved, but a lot of the MMA gloves that you'll find are like just a slab on the back of your hand and it takes weeks and weeks and weeks of training and sweating in it to kind of bend it in and get it to mold your hand. These are already molded in a way that sit on your hand very well. So straight off the shelf, you can get your hand in it nice and easy and it feels comfortable straight away. So you've already got that kind of half open hand position. Really easy to make a fist, no sort of effort to bend it in. The flat ones are a lot like that. Really sort of have to sort of crank them in to make them flat and you can grab and all the rest of it. So very nice fit straight from the beginning, which is actually what you want. Now Fairtex say that this is made from a premium leather and it is a good leather. One thing that's really, really is a pro for leather boxing gloves, MMA gloves, shim guards, all of that, is that it doesn't split or crack anywhere near like vinyl does. 
So it's well worth spending the extra money for leather because it would, it's just super durable. It's, it's able to cope with getting sort of wet and sweaty and drying out again. Definitely um, a leather product is what you want for MMA gloves. These are gonna take an absolute hammering. So you really do want that leather material because it's just gonna hold its shape and not split and fall apart sort of early on in its life. Now another thing that you've got here is you've got piping around all the edges. Now all MMA gloves should have this now. Um, in the old days, a lot of the cheaper gloves would just be cut off at the ends and they, they cut your fingers and all the rest of it. They're a nightmare. But you've got all this piping around all the edges of the material and around the thumb as well, around the wrist strap. And this just stops any sharp, cuffy edges like cutting your hands. But also if you're hitting someone else, you don't want to be cutting them prematurely. Like, I guess maybe in the ring you do, but you don't want to do that in training. It's just a nightmare if you're cutting your training partners because you're just going to run out of people to train with. It's, it's, uh, it's not ideal at all. Um, it's a very short wrap on these, like much shorter say compared to a boxing glove. You've got this elasticated strap inside so that thumb part, that thumb element isn't flapping around. And it's a nice open palm inside thumb in there so loads and loads of skin for grip again you know if you're if you're a wrestler grappling you don't want loads of material some of them in the old days would have a lot more material on the palm here so you want to be able to grip as much as possible now in terms of sizing sizing is very important um, small medium large XL is kind of pretty standard most people know where the hand is here or there now, if you, will, if you want to wear wraps while training with these, especially if you're competing, you probably want to go a size up, I reckon. So if you normally train in a medium, maybe you want to go a large for wraps, it's going to be something that you're going to have to try. If you can, come into the shop and you can try them on. You can stick a pair of wraps on and you can try them out in the shop. You definitely can do that. Otherwise, you know, as a general advice, if you use just a medium, like without anything on, Go up to a large if you want to wear wraps. Now also something about these MMA gloves, in the past almost everyone would excu exclusively wear the four ounce gloves in training. You know the sparring gloves weren't really a thing, only a few cl um, clubs here and there and maybe if it was an amateur fight and they had to wear the sparring gloves people would come and get them. But they've become a lot more popular in recent years. People are just kind of getting fed up with just getting bashed to bits in training. So a lot more people now are inspiring. And these have become a lot more popular for people that are actually fighting training for fights. So we do tend to get more uh, pro, semi-pro fighters coming in to get these, these four ounces. And people that are starting out tend to be getting inspiring gloves now. Um, not always for every club, every club's different, they've got their different rules, but as a general rule, this tends to be classed more as a pro glove. Now on the Fairtex website, they describe this glove as inside having a three layer, like a three core layered foam setup, something, something that's really good for knuckle protection and shock disbursement. Now, yeah, that kind of should be the same for all MMA gloves won't necessarily be for the cheaper ones but you do get really good hand protection on these you know for such a thin glove you do get really good protection so maybe Fairtex are on something with this three layered core foam setup thingy um, definitely you'll notice it with a pair like this compared to a cheap pair that your hand is just way more protected so that is definitely worth something thinking about if you're thinking about buying a pair of these Fairtex MMA gloves now again, going back to the early days of MMA, there was a few competing sort of big, big shows in the UK. Like some of them now, like Cage Rage disappeared, but Cage Warriors is now the biggest show in the UK and Fairtex gloves are the gloves that they use. That is the sponsored, official sponsored glove for Cage Warriors, which is absolutely great. And this is the glove that they use, the yellow Fairtex glove. So we sell this in the shop when we can get it as well, which is a really nice color. I think they're absolutely brilliant, the Fairtex gloves. But as a standard, we will get the black ones. We do also have the red ones at the moment, but they're much harder to get. Also, these gloves are the official sponsored glove for the One Championship over in Asia. Um, I've actually been to it, it's brilliant. I uh, went to see it in Singapore. So really, really good endorsements from those two shows for this glove. So at Enzo Martial Arts, we like to think we've got a pretty good selection of MMA kit for you guys. So as well, 
as the Fairtex MMA gloves, we've also got selection of shin pads, boxing gloves for tie boxing, a whole range of hand wraps, MMA shorts, rash guards, and spats. And go check out our website, enzomartialarts.com, and see the full range and all the different brands that we supply. So as promised at the beginning of the video, here is a short montage of people training and competing with the Fairtex MMA gloves. Thanks very much for watching. I hope it was useful. I hope you learned loads about the Fairtex MMA glove we have for sale at Enzo Martial Arts. If you enjoyed this video, click the little icon down below, subscribe to this channel and get all the latest videos on all the products here at Enzo Martial Arts. Thanks very much and I'll see you soon. Cheers.